Hello everyone, Hector Mendoza here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get Excel to create a folder, a subfolder, and how to combine two cells into one. Plus, I'm also going to have a PDF and a Word document to show you how to activate the developer tab if you don't have it. So, I'm going to give you an Excel file that you won't have to create your own uh, macros. So, if you look here, this is the file that I'm going to give you. So you are, you'll be able to, let's say if, um, especially for y'all adjusters, let's say if you go in and get a um, <clears throat> an Excel file with all the names, and you usually can get that from Exact Analysis. So you'd be able to select all the names. You would hit Control C. You would go into this file here and you would hit control V that would paste all of those names that I just uh, copied from a different document now at this point you would have two tabs now if it all came in one then you're not gonna have to do this next step but this step is real easy because I've already done everything for y'all so if if I go into let's say this column here I go into my developer I've already created a macro you're gonna see it a macro called combine two cells if you hit run you see it combine them all into one cell so now let's say that you wanted subfolders to each one of these folders that we're about to create you would type let's say uh, photos this is you know you want to keep your photos different than uh, let's say um, files from the insured or customer whatever you want and let's say that you are a drone operator and you have drone fo uh, footage so then you want a photo that uh, for your eyes only okay so now if I select all of those and I double click right here it's gonna create those folders for each one of the lines that are to the left okay so that's what I did by hitting that little box on the right now check this out so let's go to the desktop again this is Wherever you put this fo um, file is going to create this folders and subfolders. So you see right here, there's nothing, right? So let's go back to the Excel file. All you have to do is go to your macro. I've already created this macro for you. It says create folders and subfolders. You just tell it run. You don't see nothing happening here, but when you go to your desktop, go to your folder. I'm going to refresh my folder now you see claim number zero one and those are just random names so it, uh, remember we put a folder for drone photos files from the insured eyes uh, for your eyes only photos and it created as many names as I told it to so this is free guys I've done all the work for y'all now I do have some videos that show you how to how to do all of this so let me show you what I'm providing at the bottom of this uh, video you're gonna see three links let's say that you you already have <clears throat> the developer activated you don't need this or this I created one for word for the people that don't have PDF I created a PDF for those people that then uh, that don't have Word, so you don't have to upload every one of them. So let's go to this Excel one. If you copy and paste this into a um, browser, you're gonna get this thing come up, right? You see right here. All you have to do is click on download. Once it's finished downloading, this pop-up should come up. If you click on that folder you're gonna see that Excel file equally you would do that to your Word document and your 
uh, PDF if you need those. So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Now, I suggest if you really need something like this, for you to go ahead and grab it now because my wife is, uh, she wants me to only provide this work that I've worked for to only subscribers. So this file will still be in here in a, let's say a week or two from now. But if you're not a subscriber, you will have to get it. You have to subscribe and then you will be able to get it. For right now, I'm providing this to everybody. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and I will see you on the next video.